Um, there used to be a pattern on that dish. I could live off dal. At home, I grate a little orange rind into the yogurt. Gives it a bit of a kick. I'll try that. <laughs> or better still, come to one of our cookery classes. Anna? Ha. I run the community centre. Mm. Yasmin Nazir. Mm. People don't usually look impressed. Mm. Too busy worrying when I'm going to pounce with my collecting tin. I could do with picking your brains, actually. I'm Nicola Rubenstein. I work in youth services. I'm actually working on a bid. We've got some seed money to open up a youth centre. Where have you got in mind? Uh, it used to be a pub. The Bear and Staff. We've touched lucky. We've got a builder who's going to do the job at cost. Gold dust! <laughs> Even so, it's going to be a stretch. He's fitting it in around paid work, so he can't give us a start date or a finish date. And you can't complain? No. But... He's in that builder's yard from the crack of dawn till 10 o'clock, some nights. Um, your knight in shining armour, would that be Pat Phelan? Yeah. Do you know him? Have you parted with any cash yet? Some. For materials, why? <laughs> There's something I should know. I've given her the lowdown. She didn't believe me about that either. Go on, how is Chesney? Well, I that's... wouldn't know. Not been allowed near him, his real friends. Oh, well, that's me. The, the doctor said he needs absolute rest. Oh. He's been in a bad way, but you know what? He did book up this morning if you want to go see him. If? If she says? Yeah, do you want to come about, I don't know, five? You can't stay long though. He's just sleeping for England, bless him. I'll book him up. Little Miss Sunshine, that's me. <sighs> I hope I haven't yeah, rained on your parade. No, no, no. Far from it. Oh. Forewarned is forearmed. Bye. Thanks. When were you going to tell me about Calcutta Street? I'm uh, talking to Yasmin today. Well, Yasmin's got her own agenda. I wouldn't believe everything you hear on this street. Must have been a blow. Hard to bounce back from something like that. Yeah. It was devastating for a lot of people. You know, I considered doing a flit, but I realised that would have made me look guilty, and I was not the one to blame. You ask, hear from the horses. Say I lost all of the deposits on the flats, didn't you? Yeah, fifteen thousand pounds. Fifteen thousand reasons for me not to sleep at night. Only me and Eileen lost more. You and Jason lost everything. We lost all of Jason's inheritance, our savings, my business overdraft. My so-called business partner, that crook, Vinny, escaped with a lot. So ever since then, I've been breaking my back, trying to get back on my feet, rebuild my reputation. It's hard. Really hard. It takes grit. That's the uh, buzzword in child development these days. Teaching kids resilience. Sounds like you could bottle it. I should have told you about Calcutta history from the off, but... I wanted you to think the best of me, you know? Who wants to admit to their child that they're a failure? You're not a failure. No. You're a survivor. Big difference. Hey, I mean that. Big difference. I mean, you must know other companies that die things. 